three simple yet cool DIY projects. Planning to eat beans on toast? Don't throw away that can. Use a safety can opener to open the can. It opens the can from the side without leaving any sharp edges. Empty and wash out the can. Use a Dremel tool to cut a hole. Now glue back the lid. Put some weight on top until the glue dries. Now cover the can with a piece of paper of your choice. Well, that's it! You have made a piggy bank. Or a money bank. Oh yeah! Get a silicone mold. Cut a piece of glue from a glue stick. Put the glue in a mold and a mold in the oven. When the glue has melted, put something on top. I use these 20p coins. Now cut some more glue and put it on top. Take the mold back to the oven. When the glue has melted, put a magnet in the center. Now wait until it cools down. Remove it from the mold. Congratulations! You have made a custom fridge magnet. You can put almost anything inside of the glue. I had this clock lying around that was no use to me. I stripped it down, only leaving the core. I cut off all the switches and knobs. I took a Rubik's cube and I was going to drill a hole in the center. Then I realized that there was a hole already. One thing less to do. I took a second hand, or the hand for the seconds, and I glued it in the center of the hole. Then I removed the hand, only leaving the plastic pin. I glued some washers to the core to support the Rubik's cube. Then I put the cube on top of the core and inserted the battery. Our turning Rubik's cube is ready. What did you think? Your feedback is highly appreciated.